Hey guys, so today I'm going to be talking about, um, I got a little haul from Ulta Beauty and Target and, um, I also wanted to share my March Glam bag from Ipsy, which I think is a really, really cute bag and packaging that it came in. Um, just to quickly go through this, um, there's a lot of products in here that I've never heard of before. So there is Juice Beauty, um, Hydrating Mist for tones and refreshes. Um, I have yet to try this yet. Um, I don't really use a toner or a refresher. I usually just moisturize my face and use BB cream, but, um, if you guys have any suggestions on when to apply this, or I'm sure I'm going to experiment myself, but that's the first item. The second item is these little makeup remover wipes in a little convenient travel size, which I think is really cool. Um, I'm always looking for a new brand, even though I personally love the e.l.f. brand for $3 at Target. You can't go wrong, but um, we'll see how these work and see if I'll do a repurchase. Um, they also sent me this Glam RX little container, and like it has a mirror in it. A mirror and it also came with um, separately these are from Glam RX two eyeshadows I forget what these are from um Yabby I had never heard of them but um a very pretty like teal color and a tan color and like they're magnetic so they just stick right to this so that was my glam bag um I have to say I wasn't as impressed with this one as the February one. I really like the February one and like the January one too because like it came with a brush and um my favorite thing from the February one, let me just go in my makeup bag, was definitely this, the um Pixie Flawless and Poreless, 100% my favorite. Um next I want to go into my haul from Ulta because I'm really excited about it. Um long awaited treasure that I picked up is the Naked Flush Palette. Um, yeah, it's still in the box because I just got it yesterday, but I did use it today. Um, as you can see, it's a bronzer, highlighter, and blush. Um, I'm wearing it today, but um, it's dark outside, and this light really isn't doing any justice. So, sorry for the complexion of the video. But this is what it looks like. So, it comes in a really, like, pretty case. Um... And you open it. Nice mirror. I still have the film on my mirror. And there's the bronzer, the highlighter, and the blush. Um, I didn't use the bronzer because I am, I use my Sephora Sun Disc. But, um, I'm sure I can use it for, like, contouring or something. But I did use the blush and the highlighter. And I really liked the way it looked. So I was really pleased. This was well worth $30. So let me throw that back in the box. Um, because I made an Urban Decay purchase, they gave me, oh no, they gave me a free sample of, <laughs> should have already had this taken out, um, the Urban Decay Naked Skin, um, Beauty Balm, um, with SPF 20. I haven't tried it yet, um, but I'm really glad that it was a sample because it, this is definitely something that I would look into buying because I have the Naked, the Flawless Foundation, like the liquid makeup. Um, I really like Urban Decay and I really like their Naked brand stuff, so I'm glad this was like a little, little surprise for buying my blush palette. So Ulta's having really great sales both online and in store. You should check those out. Um, I also bought, oh, just kidding, you're right here. I also bought this kit from Tarte. Um, this was a really good value. This was $32, and everything in here is full-sized except for the, um, the eye brightener treatment because I guess it's, like, new and they just want people to try it out. So I'm going to go ahead and open this. comes in pretty purple tissue paper um so it comes with the modern eyes the shadow and the liner stick um 
This is in the color Plumberry, Plum Brown. So I usually use black mascara, uh, um, eyeliner, but we'll try it out. Um, and it came with one of these, which I've been really excited to try out. The um, Lip Surgeons. This one's in the color Smitten. Um, it's a really pretty pinky color. I can do a swatch here if you like. You can see that. So, it's very pigment minted. Um, I really like it. Um, I just didn't... I was kind of baffled when I ripped off the cover and found a sharpener, but I thought I broke it. But it's just a sharpener, sharpener, lip surgeons. But these usually go for like, I think they're either $22 or $24, but this kit was only $32. And it also came with a full-size blush, or natural cheek tint. Um, what color is this? Um, I, I don't, I don't know how to pronounce this, but a coit, a coit, whatever. Um, so again, it's a really pretty case. And when you open it up, it's like this pinky orange color, which I think would look really, really good with the bronzer that I use. Um, I haven't tried this yet. But I will be trying it soon. So I can do a review for you guys if you like. Or a tutorial with it. Um, and the last thing it came with. Was the the eye cream that I was telling you about. Um, came in a really little box. So obviously it's going to be a very little sample. It is the Mara Huaca Sea Brightener Eye Treatment. Um. So yeah, just looks like that. Just enough for a sample. Um, I guarantee that I rebuy this because um, I have dark circles under my eyes. And I usually use this product, which I showed in my last video, the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind. Um, but I feel like sometimes that doesn't always do the trick, so I have to like contour it and like put other things over it. But other than that, it does the job. Let me just pack this away real quick. Um, I also, which I've been dying to try, are these EOS lip balms. I got my first one. Um, I think it was like $3.50. It smells so good. Strawberry. Very soft on the lips. Love it. Definitely will be buying more of them. Probably making a collection out of it. Um, I also got one more, um, one more freebie from Ulta. I got a sample of the lights, cameras, lashes, and um, a primer for making a tart purchase. So that was good. I haven't tried this. I haven't even taken it out of the box yet. But that's that. Um, I also did a slight little Target haul, um, which I want to share with you guys really quickly. Um, I got this Maybelline Clean Express makeup remover because it says that it works with waterproof um, eye makeup. If any of you guys have tried this, like if you can give me your opinion on it, I'm, I haven't tried it yet, I just got it yesterday, but I've heard great things about it so I was really dying to try it. And it was on sale so, so worth it. Um, Um, I got this cute little bucket like to hold all my lip products or um, blushes or bronzers from Target. It was a dollar in the dollar section. And um, I finally got my hands on it. Nivea Lip Butter in the scent Vanilla and Macadamia Kiss. Haven't opened it yet, but I'm very, very excited to try it because I've heard great things about it. Um, yeah, so that was my little haul. Um, stay tuned for my next video. Um, I have um, a huge package from Eyes, Lips, and Face coming in, and there could be something in there for my viewers, so make sure to check out that video and keep your eyes, keep your eyes peeled.
Okay, um, leave a comment below of any of the products that I have or things that you think I should try, and especially about the Maybelline the, um, cleaner and ways that I can use my Naked Flush palette. Um, so thanks for watching. Um, yeah, bye guys.